Yo, what's up guys? You guys know why you're here. You guys know why you guys clicked on this video. It's because you, just like me, want to know what the difference is between the Mina Lima editions of the Sorcerer's Stone and the Chamber of Secrets. And that's why I'm here. I want to go ahead and find out myself. So without further ado, let's go ahead and start this video. You're a wizard, Harry. Yo, what's up guys? My name is Johnny, I go by The Collecting Wizard, and today we are taking a look at the Sorcerer's Stone and the Chamber of Secrets Mina Lima Edition, clashing them both together to check out what exactly is the difference, if there's um, a very similar pattern, um, so that way we know what to expect with the other books. As soon as I unboxed this Chamber of Secrets book, which I actually have a video on, go ahead and link it up here. Um, as soon as I went ahead and did that, I saw them both, I stared at them, and I was like, you guys are very, very similar in a lot of very different ways. If that ever makes any sense to you guys, because I know it did in my brain. And that's why we're here, we're gonna go ahead and check out the differences and the similarities between both of them. Now, looking at them face to face, if I had to look at them right now, just like I'm doing right now with this, they have very similar patterns in the same way as they have two different arches. Uh, they just have the same arch, the same decorations. Um, the only difference is, you know, the details. Uh, here you have all four houses, just like on this one. Uh, except that here you have, you know, obviously, you have the acceptance letter. And then over here, you have things like the basilisk fang and the sorting hat. It's just those tiny little differences, but it's all the same thing inside, in the front at least, in the very cover. They both have an H on the top, which signals, you know, Hogwarts. The difference is it's just based off of little details. You see here in the in the Sorcerer's Stone, you have the Golden Snitch, you have the Winged Key, you have a mouse, you have the Acceptance Letter, a Potion, a Pumpkin, and yeah, and then on the Chamber of Secrets, if you guys saw my last video, I did mention that they had a spider, they had I believe is a dagger, the journal, obviously the famous journal, even a rooster or a chicken, whichever one you guys want to go ahead and say. And you have a sorting hat as well. Now let's look at the spines because the spines is a very clear indication of what the other ones are going to be. And from looking at the spines right next to each other, they both say rolling. They both have very, very similar things except for in the Philosopher's Stone, oh sorry, in the Sorcerer's Stone because that's the one that I have on currently. And the Sorcerer's Stone, Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone, the the font Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone, um, which is the title, is actually inside the tower. Whereas in the Chamber of Secrets, the font is actually outside of the tower. And obviously the first tower in the Sorcerer's Stone is a lot bigger than the second one in the Chamber of Secrets. And that's basically it. There's nothing really crazy about it. It's just a smaller tower, which I would assume that each one is gonna have, you know, just Hogwarts is gonna look like Hogwarts um, from afar when you have all of them connected. Now the back is very very similar they both have the same things they both say the prices so nothing really crazy there. Um, let me see maybe inside no they both have acknowledgments on the back but yeah most most of the most of the similarities and differences come from the inside I mean sorry come from the outside cover because on the inside is very very similar almost per page they all have the same same thing so yeah the covers the difference is, is obviously the first Sorcerer's Stone has Hogwarts at a distance with an owl passing by the Sun with the three trio on the bottom just looking directly at Hogwarts and in the second one of course the Chamber of Secrets has Harry and Ron inside the Fort Angler with Hedwig uh, flying over the Hogwarts Express and I just noticed in front of a Hogwarts Express it has a Phoenix that's something I did not notice on the first video that I did of the Chamber of Secrets but I definitely caught it now that's very very cool I want to say it's a Phoenix it could be an owl but I would say it's a Phoenix because it's red and orange um, but yeah guys, that was just a quick little glimpse of just both of them. Just want to go ahead and show you guys the front cover and the spine because those are the big differences. And just based off of those uh, differences and similarities, you guys more or less now have a better idea of what the other books are going to look like. Um, I don't know the, the colors because obviously the Sorcerer's Stone gives a very big 
red color vibe and then the chamber of secrets obviously with a snake and all of that gives a very big uh green vibe so i don't know what the other ones would be um but yeah i hope you guys like this video i hope you guys enjoyed the differences and similarities between these two books um i hope you guys enjoyed it if you guys did definitely smash that like button down below um if you guys have not gotten these though I'm going to go ahead and link it in my Amazon storefront down below in the description. So that way you guys go ahead and cop one of those for you or both of them for you or a friend or gift it to someone that really, really loves Harry Potter like me and they'll appreciate it very, very much. But if you guys are new here, however, hi, my name is Johnny. I go by The Collecting Wizard and I talk about everything Harry Potter and theme park related content on a daily basis. So if you guys are new here and are thinking about subscribing because you're a very big Harry Potter fan, I would definitely suggest it. Hit that subscribe button down below and join the collecting family that we are. A bunch of crazy people here. Uh, so without further ado, I love you guys and I'll see you guys on the next